Good morning guys, welcome back to a weekend in my life. Today is Saturday and it is 9.30 right now. I've been up since 8.30. I just finished doing my hair and I thought I'd bring you guys along this weekend with me to another weekend in my life. Today I have a nail appointment at 11.45. So right now it's 9.30. So I thought I'd start off by getting my room a little bit more put together. doing a quick vacuuming of the room I since I just did my hair I had hair all over the floor so I just cleaned up real quick here in the bathroom and then now I'm just gonna do a quick light makeup I'm gonna get my eyebrows done today so I'm just doing something light I won't be filling in my eyebrows or anything like that quick natural makeup as you can see my eyebrows are extremely overgrown 
So I'm gonna get that done today. Like I said, I have a nail appointment at 11.45. And then after that, we'll see where we end up. I don't really have anything else that I have to get done today, but this is today's outfit. So I'm just wearing a shirt, a brown shirt. This shirt is from TJ Maxx, I believe. These jeans are American Eagle. The belt is from Amazon. The purse is from Coach. And then the shoes I got at TJ Maxx as well. These are my favorite kinds of shoes to wear. It is supposed to rain today so i need to remember to take my raincoat because i think it's going to be raining for a couple of hours and it's supposed to like downpour so it is now 10 o'clock i still need to eat some breakfast and i have some stuff that i have to pack up and take to my parents house because they need to do some yard work and all that stuff is over here so i will get that in my car now before i do anything else and then i will see what i can eat for breakfast because i don't really have anything pre-made and then we'll make some coffee it's all about us. It's all about us. It's all about us. It's time to go home. Don't want this night to end. Yeah, about time we stop pretending. Come home with me. Let's write a history. Tonight I'll make you see. It's all about us. It's all about us. just finished putting that stuff in the car so I can take it to my dad and I think I'm just gonna have a bagel but now I'm just gonna make some coffee like a light lighting up in the dark you make it right I forgot how to act it's so classic every time you make me and I lose my words It's been a while since I forgot the most simple words I'm just gonna eat my breakfast real quick, finish up my coffee, and then I will get in the car and we'll head out to my parents' house. It's 10, 15 right now, so I have time to stop by their house before my nail appointment, and we'll drop that stuff off. So I'm just gonna enjoy my breakfast because I'm starving. So I just finished my breakfast and I finished my coffee. I just need to take my vitamins for the day. So I take two cranberry pills. I was getting a lot of UTIs for some reason. So I started taking these cranberry pills. It's uh, two a day, every day. And then I take these multivitamins, which is also two of them. And then I take a probiotic because I have a lot of like acid reflexes. So this has been helping a lot with that. I was off of it for a little bit and I felt like all my issues coming back So I'm trying to be conscious of it and like take it every day um, And these are all vegan so like I know that they don't have anything bad in them I really do struggle to take any medicine or any pills like and these are gigantic I don't know how Josh takes all of his in like one swallow. I can't do that. It is actually really windy today, so you can tell that it's gonna rain. I don't think I told you guys, but I actually am going to be cutting my nails. If you can see, it's been like, I think three weeks since I went. So I wanna cut them short, and then I think I'm gonna do a French tip. This is what your hair looks like when there's wind outside in Florida. It is so windy right now. I have this little tiny hair brush. I'm gonna try to brush it out. Sometimes, but I know, I know, I know we're safe.
lost about a pound of hair. So I just finished stripping off that stuff on my parents. And then now I am going to head out to my nail appointment. It's 11.30 right now, but it's really close to here. visit to my parents house turned into a 30 minute thing to a three hour thing i did get my nails done i ended up doing just french so i finished getting my nails done at around i think it was like 2 30 and then i came over to my parents house it's now six and i am heading back home i don't know if we're doing anything tonight i josh had some friends that he wanted to hang out with but i'm not sure what's happening with that i'm craving an egg salad so i wanted to try and boil some eggs so that i can make an egg salad and then josh wants some peanut butter balls so i might try to make that for him as well it did rain a lot today so i got a call from the guy that was painting our pool deck and he said that we're gonna have to postpone it he won't be able to come tomorrow because it can't be wet so that the paint actually sticks because otherwise if the humidity is too high on the concrete then the paint won't stick so i am back home now and i am gonna start boiling some eggs so that i can make an egg salad we were only 17 Then I say I love you But we knew it was true To this day I still do Love you like I'm 17 what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut your eggs in half and then you're gonna take out the yolk and put that yolk into a bowl. 
and then with the whites you're gonna cut the cut those into small pieces and then to your yolk you're gonna add the half a cup of mustard and half a cup of mayonnaise and then you're gonna mix that all together and turn until it's well blended and then you're gonna add your salt and pepper and mix that and then you're gonna add your whites into that and you're gonna mix all that and then you're just gonna put it in the fridge for it to cool now 8 30 and we are going to get ready to go out with some friends we're gonna go to hooters and just have some food and drinks so i am going to take a quick shower and take my makeup off because i had it on all day and it's just starting to get itchy so i will catch up with you guys tomorrow I'm
decir que te amo Pero no sé si estoy mezclando una vez más Lo que me das y lo que quiero De pronto ya ya no sea mi realidad No sé si es amor es que Good morning guys, so today is Sunday. Last night we ended up just going to Hooters with some of Josh's friends and then we didn't get home until midnight. And today with the time change it was really hard to get up so we didn't really get up until 10.30. But already this morning I think I showed some clips. I cleaned my bathroom a little bit and made the bed and then we vacuumed the house. And then right now we're in the car on our way to get a car wash and to get breakfast. It's Right now it's 12 so it gets we're getting brunch. We're just going to a Cuban bakery and just getting some goodies and then we're gonna go to the car wash and clean our cars because there's been so much pollen in the air that the car is disgusting. But I will talk to you guys once we get to the bakery. I'll show you guys all the goodies that they have. To focus when you're getting close to me We're like a broken wreckage Ringing round and round all year I know that I can't do more I know that you feel the same Why do we keep playing all of these games? I don't wanna go Cause your love is what I want, babe You know that I wanna stay this way forever for a while now we just we came back from the car wash and then i just passed out on the couch so um we just had our groceries delivered it's now 6 43 so i'm gonna bring that in i wanna stay up all night with you
dinner since it's already almost seven I'm just making some potatoes and some vegan ground beef since I already have beans so we'll have that for dinner today and then I need to make my breakfast egg casserole that I make for the week for breakfast and then I'll show you guys how to make the peanut butter balls so yeah I'm just gonna any recipes that I use I'll link at the bottom of the future and what's been Cause it's the way it goes and I will never know why you So now that I have the potatoes peeled and washed, I'm just going to cut them into I would say medium sized squares. Leaving all the bad stuff and trying to remain so strong. I know it's good if I'm wrong. I got it, I got it. corner but now that I have the potatoes cut I'm just gonna add some oil to my pressure cooker and turn on the setting of saute and then we're gonna add some garlic onions and we're gonna cook them until they're a bit golden I always pre-cut my onions and my peppers and things like my carrots so I already have that ready for today and I will show you guys later how I do it remember I was laughing so up next we're gonna be doing our seasoning so I'm gonna do half a teaspoon of garlic powder half a teaspoon of cumin half a teaspoon of oregano and one and a half teaspoons of salt one half teaspoon of pepper and then half a teaspoon of Goya seasoning with culandro and achiote which is like the one that gives it like the color I'm just gonna pour them in here and just let them cook and toast for a little bit Next we're adding one can of diced tomatoes Next we are adding our potatoes Now I'm gonna add about half of the bag of brown beef And now we're gonna add one cup of water and then we're gonna mix until well combined. So this is what it looks like before cooking. So we're gonna add the pressure cooking lid. We're gonna make sure that the valve is sealed. And then we are going to pressure cook it for 10 minutes. breakfast casserole recipe it's pretty simple all you need are eggs onions peppers shredded hash browns salt pepper and um, oil we're gonna start off by preheating the oven to 350 next I'm going to spray the pan where the hash browns are gonna go in I'm gonna make an even layer at the bottom of hash browns. And then I'm going to place that in the oven while it's preheating. Once the oven has preheated, we're gonna give it an additional 10 minutes in there. Next, we're going to prep our egg mixture. I do about six eggs, so we're gonna crack six eggs into this bowl. Once we have 
cracked our eggs, we are just going to whisk them. And then we're gonna add half a cup of onions and half a cup of bell peppers. So once we have added the onions and the peppers, we are going to mix that well together. We're gonna add some pepper, some salt, and I forgot to mention we're also going to be adding cheese. I like to use the Fiesta blend cheese, but you can use any kind of cheese you want. And I just do a handful, and then in the end we're going to sprinkle some more before we put it back in the oven. So we're just going to mix that together. And this is what it would look like. We're gonna set that to the side. So the oven is preheated now, so I'm just giving that um, hash browns the extra 10 minutes. So we're gonna work on, on prepping our peppers for the week. So I like to use this shopping block from Amazon. And all I do is just cut the peppers and then use that to make them smaller. Sorry, my camera overheated and then it shut down, but while it was cooling, I finished prepping my onions and then I finished prepping my peppers. So this is eight weeks worth of onions and peppers for any meals that we make. And honestly, I love doing this. I didn't do this before, but I love doing this now because it does really make it really fast when you're going to cook a meal. It just makes everything go by faster. So our hash browns are ready. They were in there for the time that it took to preheat plus an extra 10 minutes. And then now we're just going to give this a quick mix again. And then we're just going to pour it over the hash browns and then just spread it around. And this is something that you can add like whatever you like to have in your breakfast. Like it is very customizable. So once that's all spread, I'm just gonna sprinkle some cheese on top. I like my casseroles very cheesy, so I don't go lightly with the cheese. Okay, so once that's prepped, we're gonna put this back in the oven for 30 minutes. peanut butter, protein, no fake balls. So what we need for this recipe is gonna be one and a half cups of peanut butter, half a cup of honey, one and one third cups of old fashioned oats, half a cup of vanilla protein powder, one eighth teaspoon of salt, and then one and a half cups of mini chocolate chips. You can do dark or white. Right now we only have white, so we're gonna do white. So basically you're just gonna mix all those ingredients in here in a bowl and then you're gonna roll them up into little balls. You're gonna put them on a baking sheet with parchment paper and then instead of putting it in the oven, you're just gonna put it in the fridge and after an hour in the fridge, it should be ready to eat. So just 
watch us make this and then I'll include the recipe in the description below so you guys can follow it at home. I'm a little bit naughty I'm a little bit too consumed But every part of my body Is telling me to run away from you Come a little bit closer Yeah, yeah Come a little bit closer Yeah You're a little bit crazy It's been days but you never change What's love got to do with it? He comes around better not that stuff down Come a little bit closer so now that we have all the ingredients in here we're just going to mix it together and then we'll show you guys how to roll the balls bye 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 you're a little bit selfish you get mad every time you lose You can't take me with you I'm scared you're gonna blow your fuse Come a little bit closer Yeah I can really start over Yeah In the back of my mind There's someone waiting on me You're just wasting my time Because you're scared and lonely Finally got some closure should look like as you can see it's not falling so you're gonna roll this into it should make about 24 balls if we do them my size if we do them Josh's size they're about 12 balls <laughs> so you're basically just going to grab this much I would say and then you're just going to roll it to be your friend said that you left me I'm glad that what you believe, believe. So all my ladies who got a brother that doesn't treat them right put your finger right in his face and tell that man bye bye i'm too fly i'm too fly oh, bye 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 so this is what the balls end up looking like we got we actually got 28 I think Josh overdid it with the peanut butter. But we're just gonna put these in the fridge to chill. And then we're gonna end today's video here. Thank you guys so much for watching my weekend vlog. I will try and make another one next weekend. And then yeah, we're just going to shower and eat and then just sit on the couch for the rest of the night. Josh is probably gonna play some video games. Yeah, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.